Do you think Avengers has a chance of becoming the highest grossing movie of all time? Oh yeah, for sure. Avengers is super popular right now. This is the fight of our lives. This is gonna work, Steve. I know it is. Because I don't know what I'm gonna do if it doesn't. You've probably heard of the Avengers before. You've also probably heard of Avengers Endgame by now. But do you know the significance the movie brings to the genre? I think this is going to take over. It would like open up more, let's say, types of movies for superheroes and stuff. It has like so many good characters and like messages being shown and I think it'll be a good, just a fun movie for kids to watch. The Avengers storyline started back in 2008 when Nick Fury approached Iron Man about the Avengers Initiative, an idea to bring together a group of remarkable people to defend the Earth. Mr. Stark, you become part of a bigger universe. You just don't know it yet. Who the hell are you? Nick Fury, director of S.H.I.E.L.D. Oh. I'm here to talk to you about the Avenger Initiative. In 2012, the six heroes made their big screen debut as they defended the Earth from the alien race called the Shatari. The idea was to bring together a group of remarkable people, see if they could become something more, see if they could work together when we needed them to, to fight the battles that we never could. Their adventure continued in 2015 when they reassembled to fend off the villainous robot named Ultron. Strings. Strings. In Avengers Infinity War last year, the Guardians of the Galaxy joined the fight against Thanos, but unfortunately, at the end of the movie, Thanos snapped his fingers, erasing half of the world's population and leaving the surviving Avengers devastated. You should have gone for the head. Finally, in Avengers Endgame, our heroes are set to assemble one last time to avenge the fallen by killing Thanos and undoing his terrible actions. Even if there's a small chance, we owe this to everyone who's not in this room to try. What is one prediction you have for something you think will definitely happen in Avengers Endgame? I think there are going to be a few characters that will not be coming back. I think they're going to go back in time of some sort and like stop Thanos or something. How long have you been following this franchise and what is the movie that really got you into it? The movie that really got me into it was Spider-Man 2. Well, I think it's going to open like a whole new like genre of movies where there's more crossovers with like different themes. Well, I hope that there's going to be like more diversity since like the Marvel Universe just has like they had like Black Panther and now like Captain Marvel. So hopefully like more diversity, like Asian characters. It brings more of the awareness like comic books and you know, things like that. Whereas a lot in the past that they weren't that popular, now they are. Avengers Endgame releases in theaters on April 26th. Make sure to get your tickets soon. Seats are filling up fast. I'm Zach Boniface for CBC Kids News.